Hi, my name is Shear, and I'm the founder and CEO of ShearConsulting.com, where we focus on converting the existing data from your business into massive savings and extraordinary profits. Today, we're going to learn the basics of Excel. Let's get started. So now let's talk about moving cells around inside of the worksheet. I can do it in a number of ways. I can use the mouse to select the cells I want, and as soon as I hover over the edge of the selected cells, I get four, di four directional arrows. If I click and drag that, I'm physically moving all of those. I tend to stay away from that. I'm just hitting undo to go back, which is control Z. I like to do instead a control X, which is a cut, and then click where I want to move it to and hit control V to paste. This cut and paste will always work and that's why I recommend using it for all moving needs. You can also insert new cells in between current data. So if I want to move everything down and move some stuff around that way, I click on the cell that I want, I right click and I do insert. It then asks me in this little window, do I want to shift the cells to the right or down? I want to try shifting them down. I can do this all at once across these five by doing by selecting all five, right clicking on it, hitting insert, and shifting the cells down. I can do the same thing with vertical cells. I select all these, I right click on it, I hit insert, and I shift them to the right and now I have new cells over here. The best method to move cells around is to select what you want, hit Control X to cut, click where you want to paste it, and then hit Control V to paste. The, another important reason to do that is to maintain the cell references. We'll go over that later, but that's a very important concept. And that's how you move cells around in Microsoft Excel.